Hello everyone, welcome back to part 2 of Thrill Seeker. So in this part, you're going to be beating it. You're going to be decommissioning Monty. And yeah, so we're going to want to make our way in here. Great. So now that we're in here, this is generally like one of the reasons why everyone hates this. But the entire game is the same, it doesn't randomize every time. So uh, I will show you the new code, there used to be an old one. But there is going to be a new one. And I did not memorize it, so please understand if I uh, take some time to do this because I'm watching someone else do this. And then great, so now we are going to want to flick this. And then we're going to want to do bottom three. Right over here, this one. And then we're going to want to flick this again. We're going to want to do top one. And we have to do it again. And then we have to flick this again. And then we're going to have to do bottom two. Bottom two, one. Bottom two, two. We're going to want to flick this again. Uh, this code is pretty long, so it might take a little bit for us to finish this. And we are going to want to do bottom uh, two ones. And then do it again, I'm pretty sure. Nope. No, okay, then we are done. So we can just get rid of that guy. And then we have to go through here. We have to. Nope, that goes definitely not this way. So we are going to have to go through here. Go through here. Nope. I suck at this. Let's go back to the start. So over here, you're going to have to make it. Uh, let's see, where do we have to go? What seems logical? Uh, oops. So we are going to have to turn around through here, go through here, um, go through here, here, through here, and then boom, we've made it through the vent. So I don't think the music man will be showing up, but just in case, let's, well I don't hear him yet, so I'm pretty sure that, that means we are good. That was not him. So we're gonna open it and go through here. Okay, so now you're going to want to save because I did do this first try on the first time I did it, but it is quite annoying. And to trigger this, uh, we are going to have to do this and last. Oh, I think we have to blast each one. Away. And then we are good. So this does take a lot of practice, but the second we go down, it's going to trigger a cutscene, and we're just going to have to run for it. And then we're going to have to shoot at that big one. Do you see that over there with, like, the meter? We're going to have to keep shooting at it until it's green. And then when it's green, I think all of these are going to deactivate, and we have to run to the button, and I'll show you where that is. 
So, Monty is not too difficult to avoid. Just run away from him at the immediate beginning. If you hear, like, this, the thing that he sh sees you, then just keep doing what you're doing. But when you realize he's too close, then just run away. Game of experience, jeez. Gosh darn it, I have to do all of that over again. All well, that was annoying. for sprint to get back up and run 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 like you've never ran before care until you start hearing his footsteps and feeling them. Yes, you can feel his footsteps. In case you somehow did not already know that. Absolutely not. Are you kidding me? It just keeps on the left and right. I get one, and the entire thing explodes. Okay. I see how it is. I suck with that one. Oh, I know exactly where I went, since it keeps jumping to that place, getting right in front of me, where I'm gonna have to turn around and run away. Jumped on my head. So the button's gonna be right over here. Oh, thank goodness I beat it. So press the button. Have this happen to him. It's gonna be a cutscene for the rest of this time. And he's not going to be a problem until you, uh, 
get one of the endings and he's gonna be able to move again but I don't think he can move actually as of right now so you're gonna want to go up to him uh, press I completely forget wait where do you press collect this is the most difficult part wait what there we go so you're gonna want to collect this Monty's claws and then he's gonna fade away I do I have no clue where he goes but then we're gonna want to uh, of course I don't think the music man shows up but I want to run through this anyway because I'm not gonna go back and I want to make it to the save as fast as possible Okay, great, so we've made it. You're gonna want to save, obviously. Hold on, how long did I spend on that? I spent a pretty good chunk of time on that one. So, I'm gonna save right over there. Wait, hold on, what power percent is ready yet? I'm gonna need him to be at a good one. Let's see. Isn't he at like one? No, he's at four. Okay. I was thinking of four. Okay, great. So we're gonna go back through here. Feels so good to not have to worry about the bots. Feels so good to not have to worry about Monty for a while. Definitely went the wrong way. It's over there. Yep, I see it. The escalator is right over here. So I'm gonna want to save over here. You're gonna want to save over here. Do this, and then you are home free. Of course, we'll also show you how to do the parking service part. But it's not too tricky. Gregory, are you certain you have seen a dancing rabbit lady? I believe you if you say you have, but it is highly unlikely. I have not seen her, and she does not sound like a character we have at the Pizzaplex. Okay, so we can just run our way out of here. Okay, great, so now we need to get to parts and surface, which is right near here at the main stage. I don't think Freddy's going to make it. Oh, I forgot he just does that when you can't make it. Okay. Upgrade Freddy with some claws. I'm not gonna do the Chica one uh, until I already beat the game because that one is also pretty annoying for me. The you know, shorter and better for you. So, but and you only have to do uh, it with one arm because 
it's going to automatically do them right on cylinder let's begin by opening the arm casing disconnect the colored cables to remove the old forearm it is important that you match the pattern correctly Okay, great. Great. Now place the new armature into the forearm casing. Great. Now place the new armature with the new armature inserted. Reconnect with the new armature inserted. Reconnect the colored wires. Great job. Now close. Good job. Now, use the testing console to run diagnostics and complete the procedure. Okay, and then we are done. Well done. There is no need to perform the procedure on the other arm. The auto assist did it for you. Okay, then we exit, we finish the procedure. We have some, a, a talk with Freddy, and then we can save our game and get the entire Monty thing over with. The arms are different. Where did you get these parts? I'd rather not say. How fortunate. So, so you have to wait for the top in order to save. Exactly like he did. I already did. Oh, it says mission completed. Okay. Yeah. So now we are officially done with Monty. I hope you all enjoyed the two-part guide, and I will see you all in the next one. Goodbye.